Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you install an axle drive bearing on your lawnmower, first make sure the engine has cooled. Next, you should remove the wire and boot from the spark plug to prevent the engine from accidentally starting. You should also remove the grass bag if applicable. Now lift the mower up and support it with a wood block or a comparable sturdy object. Use a half inch socket to unthread the bolt securing the wheel and pull the wheel off. Remove the snap rings securing the gear and slide the gear and washer off. Pull off the wheel cover. Next, release the large snap ring to remove the height adjustment lever and arm. Use a wrench to hold the nuts in place as you use the half inch socket to unthread the mounting bolts securing the bearing support plate. Pull off the plate and slide off the bearing retainer. You're now ready to install the new axle drive bearing. Since removing the old bearing from its retainer requires significant effort, we recommend using a new bearing retainer for installation. Position the new drive bearing in the retainer and tap it into place with a hammer. Once in place, slide the retainer onto the axle and reposition the support plate. Secure the plate with the mounting bolts and nuts. Slide the bearing retainer into place and reinstall the height adjustment arm and lever. Secure it with the snap ring. Reposition the wheel cover and replace the washer and gear. Slide the drive shaft assembly forward and secure the gear with the snap ring. Confirm that the washer is in place on the wheel cover, then insert the bolt into the wheel. Position the wheel cover, then align the wheel and mounting bolt. Thread and tighten the bolt to secure. Remove the support and gently lower the mower to the ground. Replace the grass bag if applicable. You're now ready to reattach the wire and boot to the spark plug and confirm that the lawnmower is working properly.